Hello, good morning everyone. My name is Marisol Monterrubio Velasco and today I am presenting a machine learning model that classifies a new earthquake as a potential ETA machine. This development is done in the framework of the Center of Excellence for Exascaling Solid Earth, a European project. In particular, we are working in the Urgent Seismic Simulation Pilot Demonstrator that has the objective to produce ground shaking maps and other useful, useful information required for the stakeholders, such as cyber protection, few hours after a new earthquake with large magnitude occurs. To reach this objective, we propose a new urgent computing integrated service for earthquakes workflow. The work presented today in this workshop develops a microservice inside this complex uses for earthquakes workflow. The aim of this component is to predict Adam the damage potential of a new earthquake in order to provide the information for the decision maker to ac activate and habilitate the protocol, the guidelines and the computer resources to run an urgent job in a high performance computing centers. Our method requires the information of the estimated of peak ground accelerations provided by the global seismic hazard map, socioeconomical characteristic of the affected countries, in particular, in particular that related with infrastructure, and the historical significant earthquake database that contains information on destructive earthquakes. To prepare the machine learning algorithms, we realize an exhaustive exploratory analysis of all the features provided by the databases and catalogs to finally decide that the most representative or important features are the magnitude, the PGA value mean, the index location, the focal depth, the infrastructure index and the infrastructure index quality. So once the feature was selected, we analyze our problem as a classification using as a target the modified mercality intensity scale and, the, and we define a threshold of 7 that indicates a very strong earthquakes. We use three different classification algorithms that was random forest, support vector machine and IGBoost. We plot our results in a rock space and as you can see the three of the algorithms give us similar results indicating that the power prediction is in our data. Our result is a meta model that uses a voting system to classify an event as urgent or non-urgent. Moreover, we observe that our results indicate an accuracy of approximately the 70%. We consider that such accuracy is satisfactory given the short training time the novelty of the methodology and the database quality. As an example, we show how this microservice works. Once a new earthquake is detected by the uses for earthquakes workflow, the, the, this information is automatically processed and passed through the machine learning models to predict by a voting system if it's urgent or not. In this case, our, met, uh, our models predict that it's an urgent one, that in fact that was. This is the information of the 2009 L'Aquila event that produced a uh, total damage of 16 billion euros and a lot of casualties. So we can conclude that our methodology can provide a valuable information for the decision makers in order to predict that uh, the, we have a very damaging earthquake. So thank you for your attention and if you have any comment please let me know.